Weathering the weather with Ed. Sometimes he's cranky, sometimes he's goofy, but he's always got a joke. Before I met him, I said meteorology. Hey, guy, that's not for me. But now I'm weathering the weather with Ed. All right. All right. I'm going to disconnect that. Do you know that? All right. This is our 46th show by popular demand. We're back. We have some, we have, over there, we have Gerald Hurley. On the keyboard. With the Looney Tunes. All right. All right, Jerry. Well, no, you, I want to make a statement. You're wasting time, Jerry. All right, what's the statement? Is that it? Got 26 minutes to waste. All right, then waste. we have Nikki Penta, the hostess. Hi, friends. You, we don't have any friends. No, here. we don't. <laughs> then we have... You go to too many basketball games. <laughs> <laughs> then we have uh, Bill Montague from Montague Galleries. Uh, Bill, by the way, is a new sponsor. All right, oh, Bill. All you. right, all right. You know that notice we sent to really help. Rob. <laughs> <laughs> How, how, are, how are things going at Montague Gallery? Then? Fine. It's, uh, when I left, everything was great. Well, there won't be anything later. When All I right. Back, yeah. Then we have, <laughs> here's a return visitor who this time reminded himself to bring flowers this time. And uh, that's because I kept hounding you. You gave me a list of all the things you were allergic to. and I You just haven't introduced <laughs> him yet. <laughs> He's going to bring ragweed. But you haven't introduced him yet. Who no. is he? I have no I idea. Know. This is my... Be in my second. Do you have that on the paper there? Would you take your shoulder pad off? This is Michael Spanos. All right. Oh, thank you, sir. From where? I'm from Westford, actually. The hey, Floral yeah. Arts in hey. Westford. I was going to say that. Oh, you were? I'm oh, sorry. Will you right stop tiptoeing through the floral air? Floral Arts in Westford. Wow. All right. He's from Floral right. Arts in. W oh yeah. He's not only that. He's the owner. He's the big man. And boy, you're getting big there, buddy. <laughs> Give me five, sweetie. Oh yeah, sweetie. What the hell is it? The hand you're bring that out, yeah, Are no. you retaining water again? <laughs> <laughs> Not around the neck, please. All right. So we have flowers here hidden by the table here. <clears throat> you do. You see? Oh. All right. I'd like to re-announce that uh, that we're gonna have we're gonna have. I'm I'm Dean Martin. We're gonna have. I like it. I like Thank it. you. We will surely have a correspondent in the field. Yeah. What field? Can I? I'm serious. <laughs> I'm oh, just curious. <laughs> You're going to be in the field, outstanding in it. The wheat field. Novena Bents, of Sh Novena Bents of shows 43 and 44 fame has graciously, that's graciously. Graciously. Agreed to be our field correspondent located <laughs> in the great state of Texas. Let's hear it for oh. Texas. Oh. Yeah. Will she be outstanding in the field? No, you'll be outstanding in your field. <laughs> in Austin, to be exact, you know, Austin. I met Novena. Go to yeah. Very nice girl. Yes. Good job. We're actually carrying our line of jewelry in the store now. I can't carry it because it's too heavy. For is me. it too heavy for you? Yeah, I get, I get hernia. Get those little fingers? George, George, you're not George. You're not. No, <laughs> it wasn't Bill, when I come in, Bill, but I, Bill, it might be you, when I leave. Yeah, <laughs> Bill Bill has his, her line of jewelry, too. Yeah. Nice. How are things going? Things are going well. Are, are they? they? Yes. Things growing? I'm not talking things about flowers. Business I'm growing? not talking about flowers. <laughs> how, are, how are things going? Things are going well. Things are going well. Uh, we, right. we, have, we have just started to put out all her line of jewelry and... Uh, just Pretty getting, good. yeah, just getting people acclimated to what we carry there. You know, we carry a whole bunch of different things, from fresh flowers to plants, which are down at your feet there that you. Wait a minute, I'm talking about jewelry here. Don't give yeah. me this. Well, it's right. jewelry. We do, you know, all kinds of different different things. So. Yeah, you have a bakery there too, right? Well, we have a out. coffee shop coming. Actually. All right, thank you. I'm not interested. All right, so. Not interested in coffee. We don't, can we have the website up on the screen, <laughs> or not? Oh. <laughs> there it is. Oh, yeah. www. Oh, yeah. Dot .novenabents.com. Remember that. Buy. Buy everything, right? Oh, yeah, okay. absolutely. Yeah. A little more enthusiasm. Oh, absolutely, Ed. Uh, all right. Novena will be... <laughs> <laughs> Novena will be... Yes, you have trouble I, reading we, it? Nove yes, I do. Novena <laughs> will be reporting on the environment, culture, and the arts. Why am I yelling? The jewelry that Novena designs can be seen by going to her website, which was up before, www.novenabents.com. We don't want to put it up. There it is. Big. Oh, there it is. Oh, Very good. Excellent. Her jewelry, can o her jewelry can also be seen by watching show 44. Let's give Novena, Novena, my God. Novena, Novena. <laughs> give Novena, Novena a big weathering the weather with that round of applause. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. 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 Now, Ed, you Is that all there is over there? What? Ed, so yeah. you can buy the jewelry at Ted Walden Street at Montague. Gallery, that's right. Oh, they don't even have that. Art. At Floral Arts in Westford. What's the address? 129 Littleton Road. Littleton, 110. This gentleman Little over here. 
Oh, I forgot what I was going to say. Mm-hmm. Well, you're the owner, right? And you're also a sponsor. I am a sponsor as well, yeah. How about you, Jerry? Well, I know Bill became a sponsor, and I'm thinking about it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> you cheapskate. All right. I don't usually rush into things, you know. You're I not rushing, that's a right. Thoughtful How person. is the uh, potato famine going? Is yeah. that all right? Great. Well, he says that because I'm Irish. No, really? With a name like Hurley? I thought it was Hurley. Yeah. All right. And I'm actually an Irish citizen, so. Are you going to read us something? We don't care. All right. All right. Now, I want to get serious here for a moment. I was serious, but they annoyed me. I understand. I, and, yeah. No, you don't. A, a, an editorial on global warming. Global what? warming? Come on. Give me an intro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is science, bucko, not loony. Oh, no. Come on, cut it out. No, well, you know, I, I, there goes your salary. Get it takes me here. time to think because what kind of a song would you play for climate? Uh, climate. The thing they do for uh, uh, Don Rickles. Warming <laughs> weather. <laughs> oh. That's it. Get out of here. This Stormy me, weather. All right, stop it. All right. Well, Stormy oh, weather. Thank you. It's on global. Okay. You, right. mean, you don't get out. Global, <laughs> global warming. <laughs> global warming. For those of you who think global warming. <laughs> global. Global. <laughs> global. Global. All right, take two. If you go to high school, you, will you be quiet? For those of you who think global warming doesn't exist, think again. <laughs> Many people are in denial, and I don't mean the Nile River in Egypt. Come on. Oh. All right. Hey. All right. A zinger. <laughs> Stop That's that. That's a good one. All right, July 2015 and the year 2015 to date are the warmest globally on record. That's globally, folks. August was above normal for much, if not all, of the United States. Really? Right? Mm. Wow. Mm. Mm. And there, there was record heat in Europe this summer. Mm. There are 100 in yeah. London. There are 100. You, thank you. September well, has Celsius started off. Fa- they don't use centigrade over there. They don't use Fahrenheit. They use cel- centigrade. People here don't. Got it? Where do you think this is going? It's going to Europe, right? Going on YouTube. Let them convert. <laughs> <laughs> Let my people go. Oh, sorry. Uh, they get millimeters. Let's not get political. That's it. Sustem- I am. September has started off hot, and no sign of autumn can be found at, at autumn. <laughs> right. I mean, we just had a this particular time. Autumn was late last year also. You remember. Mm. The northeastern part of the U.S., had a good deal of snow and cold last winter, but that was the exception. Come on now. Yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> Why are we clapping for that? I don't know, because I need it. <laughs> <laughs> there is a certain political party in the United States that continues to insist that global warming does not exist. Yeah, 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 yeah come on. Yeah. I don't know if the whole party, but a part of the party. Uh, it's a party, not a party. Party. You Where want you a party? party. It's out back. You from New York? <laughs> yes. Uh, this party New shall York. remain nameless. New However, York. it is called the Republican Party. Mm. Oops. I let the feline out of the bag. You like this? Yeah. Thank you. The leading candidate for president of the United States. Stop playing with the flower. Sorry. Oh, they smell great. Well, lonely, well, well, the leading candidate for president of the United Better States, Donald. Donald. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Donald Trump that also that believes that global does. warming does not exist. Ah, come on. Huh? Yeah. But you know, only 2% of the scientists uh, <laughs> deny. Uh, almost all of the, 98% of the scientists do believe in global warming. That is correct. The other two are crocked. They're in denial. Go call Cairo. Well, uh, or they are being supplemented by companies that want to deny it. Yeah, thank you. you yeah. heard that's our editorialist. Yeah, I read yeah. books. You that's know. clever. That's but good. we're running out of time. I got to be done by minute. Is Many the people end? choose to call it. Don't interrupt. I'm just checking to see if it was at the end of the editorial. Many people. <laughs> <laughs> he never lets us know when he ends. You know, you know I'm I the know. boss here. So it I'm has about nine different endings. We're getting close. Many people choose to call a problem climate. Will you stop it? It's a big finish. Many people choose to call the problem climate change. I say call the problem what it is, global warming. Oh, sorry, global warming. Why are you trying to hit me? Warming. Because I hate you. You're warming? Get out of here. <laughs> Let me repeat that, global warming. All right. Mm. The heck with all the political. Sound like you're from New York. No, it's yeah. serious. Shut up, please. <laughs> the heck with all this political correctness. The term is global warming. Yes. All right. And since you didn't give me, since you didn't give me, and since you didn't give me my time, I'm not going to say thank you for your time. All right, let's All hear right. it here. We have a few. Thank yeah, you. Very no, good. Thank See, you. this is what happens when you let the inmates loose in the right. asylum. We All right. Yeah. <laughs> this is, I'm not, we shouldn't be laughing about this. You're not this laughing is, about it because you serious. people are disturbing me. 
Mm. You are Thank already you, disturbed. View, uh, beside the viewers' yeah, comments on my global started. warming editorial that was supposed to have been read without interruption. From uh, Vicky of Nashua. You remember the store, don't you? Oh, I do. Oh, yeah. I, stop it. <laughs> I have lived in Nashua for 62 years. She's only 25. It's interesting. Mm -hmm. And I can assure you that the summers now are much hotter than they were mm -hmm. when I was a kid. Mm. Right. Jerry's concurring. A little louder. I can remember people who didn't think we needed air conditioning in New Hampshire because yeah. we only had a few hot days each year. Nobody thinks that anymore. Nobody thinks that. No, unless they're True. Nobody thinks anymore? Thank you. People can deny this all they want, but the birds and plants don't know. It's a political issue. They are changing where they live and grow. That is correct. Mm -hmm. It certainly is. Here, here. It's too a little British. Here, here. Here, here. There, there. All right, now. <laughs> don't. Now, here, watch him play a song called Don't. <laughs> now, we have from Lisa in Connecticut. Uh, she lives near Hartford. I can't figure out. I can't remember where. Mm. It's Go Ed. That's what she said, with exclamation mark. How do you read all that off a blank sheet of paper? It's not <laughs> blank. <laughs> oh, there it is. All right. Now, and finally, from, oh, oh, here goes from David of Chelmsford, please don't hold back. Exclamation mark, three dots. Good. All right. <laughs> You know, you well killed done. it. Thank you. Come well on, give me a hand. Give me a hand. Oh, I got a hand. Thank <laughs> you. We got a hand at you. Slip me five. Oh, I don't want to. All right. Now, let's do a little one here, then we'll get to the lightning heavy rain creates chaotic first weekend for college football. You're, you're, a, you're a pro. Read this. Oh, I should rephrase that. <laughs> Holy mackerel. Go ahead. Mackerel is right. I mean, what is this? What font is that? He's reading a blank page. Right. Make it shrink it to get it to fit. You don't have to read anything. Oh, you just recite something. To Can we up? settle down here? You're going to go to the principal's office. <laughs> we uh, severe. Okay. Lightning heavy rain <laughs> creates chaotic first weekend for college football. <laughs> you take off your glasses. So read. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, will wow. you read this? Yeah, she's a wonderful <laughs> reader. Yeah, when she reads, it's not interrupted. Pick it up. Right. We're going to have to slow well, the up. font is pretty tiny. Oh, I had to shrink it to will fit on the page. Will you please oh. read it? She's working on it. Go. Oh, she's not. She's she's trying trying fans danced it. in the rain, storms stormed the field, or he headed for the exits during weather delays. Yeah. One game was cut short with almost 10 minutes on, left on the clock, and another was postponed for a full day. Mm -hmm. Here's a look at how the weather affected games around the country. Stay off the field. A uh, fan was tackled by security when he darted onto the field during a delay for lightning in the third quarter of, the num of number 25 Tennessee's matchup with Bowling Green. He ran across the painted <coughs> tee at midfield and reached the 36 before a security guard took him down. He was quickly hustled off the field. That's farther I can reach, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> that's good. That's good. I would have run um, out of bounds. In Cincinnati, bored students stormed the field as rain fell in sheets during a delay in the Bearcats game against Alabama A&M. All right, one wow. more because we're running low. We'll just call the whole thing off. Yeah. Thank you. That's his song. Forget it. <laughs> All right, thank you very much for that contribution. <laughs> you know, Dad, we're not doing a roast It's a great here. story. I like this. Thank yeah. you. Okay, what's good. next on the show? All right. Yeah, what's next? Yeah, everybody. Yeah. Because I like the audience. Audience. Yeah, the, audience. Audience. <laughs> the peanut gallery <laughs> wants to know. The audience is control. Right. control. I lost control. You only got 15 right. minutes All right, left. Bill, go ahead. Uh, Read something. Okay. What? Read one of your poems. Can we put Bill's books up? Why am I yelling? I don't know. Can we put, uh, can we put down to 1318? Oh. Please put some of Bill's books up, please. Thank you very much. Oh, Bill at a young age. That gave you know, me that's a Bill. Bill. <laughs> that is Bill when he was a young, you know, yeah. a, a youth. That's supposed to be the price. Six years old. Yeah, I put the price on there, too. I just said that. You gonna Did you say that? Bill? Huh. All right, next, this is Bill. next one, please. Next. Okay, let's hum. Next one. <laughs> There it is. Uh, this is no uh, poem. That's ten years ago, Bill. Let's see if I can find that one in here. So, okay. All right. See. Thank you. No poems. All right. Done? Now our, uh, the third book, please. Okay. Do you want or a not. poem from my book? What's this? Transcend that that looks like a love, love poem. poem. Yes. Yeah. You want a love poem? All right. Will you read one, please? We're running a love out of time. poem. We're gonna have to skip you, Bill. Transcendental love poems. Wow. Are we allowed to say that here? Skip yeah, all the way from the You can't skip. Bill, come on. Read something. Nobody okay, here's one called it. Distant Love. Di love is strongest and lasts the longest at a distance, for it's always at stage one. Wow. Stage one? All right, let's tell you how. Mm -hmm. Ever, uh, come on now, will you? Farewell to love. Yes. Our most heartbreaking emotion is to say farewell to love. Oh. A 
How about that? That's deep, baby. I like it. <laughs> what are you doing over there? Are you doing a wedding? No, it's a sad. It's, I it's play the minor sad. chord. Mm -hmm. I'm sad over here because of the heckling <coughs> stuff. Are you all right, buddy? Excuse me, I'm you all right? Thank you. Yes. You're looking good. I'm allergic to flowers. Oh, he's allergic <laughs> to the floor. One more, Bill, please. Okay, this is called In Love. Falling in love is like jumping in the ice cold ocean water. It's impossible to describe the feeling, but you know it when you're in it. All right. <laughs> this man is uh, he's a, he's like a thank you. That's, that's good. He likes that one. All right, very good. That's good. Get out. All right, now, Jerry, you want to sing a song, please? Jerry, Finally. Finally, <laughs> come on to Jerry. Gee whiz. You only got 11 minutes left. Well, you know, I. Uh, oh, first of all, thanks for inviting us back. Your nice band uh, just got That's, that's okay. Sorry, yeah, I was as, that's okay. As I've said before, I, I always try. Will, will you two knock it off, what? please? Knock what off? This is not a Tonight Show. I'll be good. I yeah, mean, yeah, it was okay. tells us. Yeah, emulate this. I always movie. try to do songs that have something to do with the well, weather. That's because it's by request. So, um, here's a song. It begins, Gray Skies Are Gonna Clear Up. Not tonight. Uh, not tonight, but maybe tomorrow. Eventually. Put on a happy face, <laughs> and then uh, the, later on it says, um, spread sunshine all over the place. So do you, do you want me to uh, play and sing this song? I have a question. How come you get the close-up and I get the long, long shot all the time? I think that's the pullback. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Uh, gray skies are going to clear up. Put on a happy face. Brush off the clouds and cheer up. Put on a happy face. Take off the gloomy mask of tragedy. It's not your style. I've never used this keyboard before. Can you tell? You used it last well, I can tell you. Yeah. yeah. You look so good, you'll be glad that you started to smile. There go the pleasant outlook. You didn't practice again, did you? No, I didn't practice. I've been really busy. <laughs> Stick out the happy grin, chin. Chin, Wipe grin, off chin, that bowl of doubt look, <laughs> slap on a happy grin, yeah. and spread, here's the weather, sunshine oh, all I over the <laughs> place, <laughs> put on a happy face. You know, you know, remember that Very good. Yeah. You remember that doubling? You know, that's one, reason, that's one reason I haven't practiced so much is I've, I never got the check yet. I in mean, the mail, yeah. you want the check? Go to check. Go to the check report. And I thought, Mary, I thought you said it was in the in the mail. The it check. got burned. So the birds right. ate it. It went to floral arts. He's been watching reruns of the uh, Weathering the Weather with Ed. He hasn't had time to practice. That's yeah. right. What have you been watching? Yeah. Not the show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's a good one. Well, good one. Oh. All right. All right. <laughs> You want to get out of here? Uh, All right. <laughs> now, a, so, like do you have another one you want to do? Because we seem to be have too much time. N no, I think. Uh, you want, why do we hear about the flowers? Nikki? What do I want to say? All right. Yeah. Well put, Nikki. I'm your reader. Yeah. Here, read this on. Uh, read that. That's about flooding. Thank you. Global warming and El Nino. Go ahead. Oh. More U.S. coastal flooding <laughs> forecast. Global warming and El Nino are cited. Federal scientists say, said Wednesday that they expect nuisance flooding That's to yesterday. increase in many places along the nation's coasts in coming months. A combination of sea level rise from human-caused global warming and the giant El Nino will likely combine to increase the type of minor street flooding that causes much inconvenience but no major damage, according to the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, but or NOAA. NOAA. Yeah. NOAA. You probably think it's an arc. <coughs> In 10 of the 20, 27 coastal communities that NOAA examined, scientists predict the number of nuisance flood days to increase 33 to 125% wow. with the current large El Nino. And it's likely to be the worst in the mid-Atlantic region where nuisance floods could happen about once a week from New Jersey to North Carolina. Well, fortunately, it's not here. Wow. Thank God. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, it's not, what are you, Reverend Bryant here? Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> the nuisance flood season runs mostly from fall to early spring. Yes. NOAA oceanographer William Sweet explained, ex examined data going back to 1920 in some cases and found the flooding is not only increasing with climate change and rising seas. However, he said, some of these areas you can get it with no rain at all, like high tide pardon? flooding. No. Mm. The report did, in, did not indicate that Boston or Providence would experience increased nuisance flooding. Okay. Yeah, but we don't care about the Fenway. Yeah. Right? All right. Oh, stop it. <laughs> All right, now let's go to floral arts. Let's go. Let's yeah. go. This gentleman let's is go. on. Let's go. 
<laughs> Tell us about flowers. All right, uh, last time, last time, this time, last time, when this gentleman, uh, gentleman, when this creep. <laughs> Thank you. I don't know. Give me nice. five, baby. Mm. With the backhand. Give me <laughs> five and a mouth. This gentleman five. here. Give me five and a uh, mouth. I don't know how your mother puts up with it. She does. This, uh, she does. She does. With your wife. All right, this gentleman came here last time, and he didn't bring anything. I did this time, didn't I? He did. He certainly. Too bad they're hidden by the table. All right. What do we have here, kind sir? Oh, this is a typical arrangement of what we send out every day. Wow. It includes white hydrangea. We've got some You're roses. You're making it fall off something. Mm. We've got yeah, here. Put this in. Put this in your teeth, there, Ed, and you can. Hey, you want to play me yeah. some uh, tango? The, what's <laughs> what's this? This is feverfew. Wow. Yeah, feverfew. Yeah, wow. Yeah, feverfew. It grows Ooh. wild now and. Um, Where? Now, Mike, from what countries do you get these uh, we flowers? We get flowers from all over the world, actually. Really? I mean, uh, really? Uh, yeah. I mean, for example, this hydrangea is from Holland. Wow. Uh, the stalk is from California. Where are your roses? Are from? from South America. Where are your poppies from? <laughs> these are bells of Ireland. Actually. Oh, well, I bells of Ireland. Ireland. They fly you want to take that home for they dinner? They do. They fly oh. Wow. Now, how do they keep them fresh on the airplanes? And uh, put them in water? On the big farms, these flowers are, are, are cut. Um, cut manually many times by workers and they're, they're pulsed with what they call STS, a silver thiol sulfate. Oh. Uh, it's, a, it's a food that helps them survive the transport. Right. They're okay. packaged, cooled, and immediately shipped. So wow. we get them the following day. Wow. Really? Uh, they go into, you know, for example, South American flowers import into Miami. Uh, and then from there, they're, they're checked for drugs and whatnot, and then they're sent up to the, wow. uh, the uh, I'm every day, yeah, in uh, Boston markets. In Columbia, baby. In Columbia. Well, you know what? Come straight here. <laughs> Flower imports used to be a uh, big smuggling oh. uh, point for, really? for a lot of the Now, so yes, America so can't grow enough flowers for e the oh, businesses here? Winter. Well, I mean, their, their climate, you know, speaking of the oh, weather. Oh, the climate. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. They have <laughs> climate yeah. there. <laughs> it's our they sun. Can, he they, did it again. That's right. We have winter. Yeah. That's Very right. good. Yeah. So it, it, it uh, takes good. a lot of energy to, to heat up a greenhouse in the yeah. middle of January, February. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, really? Uh, well, open the window. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank so you. Good good question. Yeah. Must I be a huge plane so. to All right. bring that in. All right. Thank you. Oh. Now, thank you. For bring, <laughs> not saying I'm saying. I'm sorry. Yeah. All right. What else do uh, you have here? You want, I'll bend down and get this. Oh, my back. Holy crap. It's hot. It's heavy. What? Come on. Yeah, you it's Put hot. your glasses down and hold it. <laughs> Can I autograph your knee? Go ahead. This is a uh, just a... Uh, a solid planter. We, you know, we can plant up little dish gardens for people. They love these because they oh, there you they are. You're on a close up. Oh, mm -hmm. wonderful. They last from uh, you know weeks and weeks. Uh, some people keep them for years. I don't, I don't know, know how you get this is a colancho. I don't know African how you get these yeah. to stay in the English house, though. They usually oh. yeah. croak. But my, yeah, here, see, I have pots like that. When but you know, when I out. put plants in them, they don't last because. There's no, uh, there's no drainage hole in the well, bottom. One, right? one remedy for that, if you don't drill out the bottom, if you don't put a hole in the bottom to, to right. let that excess water drain out, yeah. um, what you should do, quite honestly, is fill the bottom of that pot with about two inches of stone. Uh, that'll allow the water to drop down in there, oh. and the roots won't, um, you know, get R waterlogged. Okay. Right. Yeah. Oh, that's a good idea. So it actually uh, do much, much uh, better. Jerry, for you. how come you don't a ask these interesting questions when I'm doing weather? But you don't well, well I'm very interested in flowers. Thank you. you. Know, I have a big garden. We maybe, don't get to the root maybe of what you're saying. Maybe you can buy some saying. of my uh, dandelions. Well, it's hard to say something. Oh, you have a lot of dandelions. Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. Right. All right. What else? You trust me with this. You think you're going to break that? You're trying to get me out. What are you trying to do? This is something that even you could do it. Wow. Oh, those are all. Are you insulting me? No, of course not. Those are all permanent little vases. These are all the little vases on a tray, and they're all permanently adhered to it. Yeah. Nice. They, what you can they, honestly they, do is just are purchase. They glued to it or they're with it when they build it? Well, they're all individually made and then. But then they. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, connected wow. to it. Whoa. Um, so what do you call them? What do you call them? Well, I mean, you know, a lot of people buy these and they just buy a few blooms and they'll mm. they'll just cut a bloom oh. and stick it in the vase. It's very, very oh. simple. That's why I said, even Ed, you could do this. Could, yeah. You know? Did you buy that at ja <laughs> Jacobson Floral? This is floral? actually from Jacobson Floral. That's yeah. right. Yeah, he's a friend of mine. Another plug. We tell them to contribute, yeah. please. No. Oh. I'm gonna be a sponsor. I, I'm not going there because I've had so many hernia operations. <laughs> what the heck well. is it? Hold on to me. Now this is this really no, that one's a little heavy. This is something. It is not. Hey, there's a snake in. You can put that on here. I'll hold it, please. <laughs> All right. Oh, good hold that up. We have a oh. close up of this beautiful thing. Oh, this is, is something. This that is a uh, Phalaenopsis orchid. It's actually of artificial. Um, I've it's artificial? Yeah, I've created it in wow. here to, to make it appear real. And we do a lot of these for 
office environments, oh. uh, even people's homes. Wow. Um, what is this? This is Curly Willow. I think you probably I remember yes. him from Brooklyn. <laughs> oh, do you know? Cur get him remember Curly, don't you? So yeah, it's actually is planted in there, and um, oh. it's in a styrofoam base, and this is a concrete pot. Oh. Wow. And, uh, Did you say, uh, now, where where is this from? This these uh, orchid. Oh well, these orchids are you know I mean Thailand is where you yeah, where they I predominantly come from. Wow. Yeah, but this to be this again, this is artificial. But artificial. I mean, the uh, even the artificial the, the silks that come in now they're so realistic looking. That yeah. 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 Mm. Yeah. Oh oh, so that's not all. Th that that's not also real. from Thailand. How much, even though they're artificial. A lot of the imports are from yeah are from Thailand. Can I have an idea? Estimate what this might be. But don't say in dollars. How about euros? How about what do you got? <laughs> the pound? Maybe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, or down to one nineteen with the ball up. Call. What do you got? What do you, how, no, how I mean, much? you can, you can, uh, for something like this, for example, you can spend anywhere from ninety-five to two hundred and fifty, three hundred dollars. Excuse oh, wow. me, you're talking to me. Let's yes, get this wow. down for you, Ed. <laughs> buck down, buck a week, baby. <laughs> I mean, all right, <laughs> all right. You'll probably a, give me, you'll, he'll give me a dead artificial. <laughs> it's oh. a good investment because you don't have to buy it again. It, Indeed, it, yeah. It, yeah. It, you yeah. want to talk yeah. about your garden there, Jerry? Great. Jerry. Well, no, I, I have uh, quite a few different uh, flowers. And no, I, I enjoy flowers. That's well, having never been invited to your house, I don't know what you're talking about. You well, I hardly know you. <laughs> <laughs> Believe it, baby. We didn't uh, know you were portable. We thought you were yeah. a fixture. I'm portable, yeah. You really, do yeah. you ever get to Concord? I hardly know you. No, never, never. Uh -huh. I hang out at the Dunkin' Donut. Dunkin' Donuts in Concord. Near Concord. the station. We got right. 31 oh, seconds wow. to go. Uh, what? Well, lo look, it's almost over. I drink to everyone's health. Hey, I want to thank our guest Just tonight. A few notes at thank you. Up oh there. my God, the hand! All right, don't hit that; it hurts. All right, will you stop it? Keep playing. I say this sincerely. You got Thirteen seconds. What are you going to do for the last thirteen? I want to thank next it's week. Been fun. We have enough. Will you stop it? We don't have a show for two weeks for the chief seat. Hey, oh boy! boy. Stop it! You'll miss us. Where Ira <laughs> Kelts will be here. All, All right, right. All right. Let's go. Let's shake it up. All right. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's go. <laughs>